Hello! If you're an engineer who is new to Notion, this video is for you. I'll show you how you can use us to manage your tasks and keep your team aligned on all processes. We'll use this workspace for a fictional company called Acme Inc. To get your workspace set up quickly, there's a few pre-made templates designed specifically for engineers. To access them, click on templates in the sidebar and find the engineering category on the right-hand side. If you like one, hit use this template and it will be added to your workspace. This engineering wiki is a space where you can create and store all of your team's important documents and make them visible to any team member. Neatly stock knowledge for new hires, code style guidelines, or QA philosophy. Keeping all essential documents in the same place allows everyone to be aligned, whether they are employee number 5 or 200. As you can see, this wiki page hosts many pages within it, which we call subpages. Subpages can host other subpages within them. In fact, you can nest pages inside pages indefinitely. A quick way to visualize this structure and access subpages is by clicking on the toggles to this effect in the sidebar. If you often work with the same subpage, just mark it as favorite and it will always appear at the top of your sidebar. Undo this action by clicking here again. To create a new page, place your cursor wherever you want, hit the forward slash key, then type page and enter. A new blank page is created. Give it a name, an icon, and add all the content you want. Remember that this engineering wiki template is just a suggestion, something to help you visualize what you could build for your own team. Notion is highly customizable, so you can shape this team wiki to your needs or simply create a new one from scratch. Your team may want to create a database like this one to oversee and manage engineering tasks. What's great about Notion databases is that each entry is in fact a page in itself where you can store all the information you want. This at the top is what we call properties, which are pieces of information about every task. They allow you to include useful information, such as the person the task is assigned to, its status, priority, or due date. As an engineer, you may want to add tags to each task. In this case, you would add the tag property and create new tags by simply typing them in the text box and hitting Enter. Want to know who was the last team member to update the task page? Add the last edited by property, and the person in question will automatically show up. From here, you can add more properties to reflect how your team operates. You can keep track of your QA status, add a GitHub URL, sprint number, or whatever you need to stay organized. Use the rest of the page to add content related to the task, like text, code snippets, or embedded content like flowcharts from Whimsical, designs from Figma, videos from Loom, and many more. For code snippets, note that you can change the code language. Click on the dropdown at the top left and select the language you want. You can also quickly copy the code by hitting copy at the top right. What's more, click on the toggle to wrap your code and untoggle to unwrap it. To embed a GitHub gist, simply hit the forward slash key then GitHub and press Enter. Paste the gist here and you're good to go. You can embed code from CodePen just as easily. To see all the things you can embed with Notion, just hit forward slash, embed, and scroll down the list. Click out of your database entries page to go back to your database. Here, you'll notice that tasks are neatly grouped by status. This allows team members to simply drag a task from one column to the next until completion. You may want to display your tasks differently, by assignee for instance, or decide to view these same tasks in a table or a list. With so many customizable options, you can make your database as complex or minimalist as you want. Learn more about database views in our Introduction to Databases video. And one more tip for engineers. To reduce eye strain, you can turn on dark mode. Just go to the Appearance section in Settings and Members and select Dark from the drop-down or use the keyboard shortcut Command-Shift-L. That's all for this run through. As you can see, Notion can be whatever you want it to be, a team wiki, a tasks manager, or a quarter by quarter roadmap. We hope you now have a good idea of how Notion can help you and your team build great things together.